Hello everyone, this is a uh, hot water service. It is an 80 litre hot water service running a low voltage uh, element in instead, instead of mains element. As you can see, it comprises of a uh, double circuit breaker. One is actually to switch the uh, photovoltaic um, panels off and the other one actually turns the elements off onto the hot water service. And what, what happens is uh, the blue and the brown wire basically basically is controlled by the MOSFET this is the MOSFET with a big heat sink and fan on it and it's actually temperature controlled to turn off and on when the MOSFET gets too hot I've got a little probe underneath there you can actually see there under the MOSFET that actually is uh, is controlled by this little readout here and this readout if the MOSFET gets up to around 47 degrees the actual fan turns itself on and cools the MOSFET. Um, as you see here, there's another two digital readouts. The red one is the actual top temperature of the water tank, and the blue one is the bottom temperature of the uh, 80 litre tank. And what ends up being, you'll see see these uh, little little black and red wires. They actually go down to the um, to the thermostat, and the thermostat is there. And what ends up being all the thermostat does is to allow the switching on and off of the MOSFET. And uh, that's all it does. You can actually see the, the element there. It's only 1200 watts. Uh, that's if it's actually running at its rated voltage. But because the voltage is only running at about 30 volts instead of uh, 36 volts. Uh, I'm not getting the full 1200 watts. You'll see a little probe there that actually measures the bottom of the tank and two power packs um, that run 12 volt the reason why there's two power packs is I've got to run them on separate systems because if I incorporate the fan into the MOSFET switch you get a bit of um, feedback from the coil of the fan and the actual MOSFET will not switch off at all so that's why there's two 12 volt separate systems on the uh, setup so one does the MOSFET switching and the other one does all the readout of the uh, digital temperatures